At the end of World War II, the American government were desperate to get hold of the Nazi rocket weapons, which had wrought havoc on the innocent people of Britain. The American government launched Project Paperclip, which secretly changed the war criminal files on Werner von Braun and his colleagues. Files which described these SS officers as an ardent Nazi were changed to read not an ardent Nazi. Werner von Braun, his team and the rocket factory at Peenemunde, which had terrorized Western Europe, was transported to the USA lock, stock and barrel. It soon became clear that the Nazis had a secret space program at Peenemunde and Nordhausen. The Hanabu craft utilized alternative propulsion systems such as Vril power, possibly back engineered from recovered crashed flying saucers. The interior of an entire mountain was excavated to accommodate a secret space facility which was no less than one million square feet. It was here at Nordhausen, in top secret underground bases, that a huge number of experimental rocket ships and circular flying disks were developed. The prototype V-7 craft was powered by engines manufactured by BMW. The V-7 used 12 BMW 028 engines which were powered with helium. Radical fuselage shapes were developed which would later lead to the emergence of stealth aircraft and the cruise missile. Werner von Braun and his team closely studied photographs of UFOs which had been photographed in Germany, Austria, Switzerland and Russia.
these unidentified flying objects inspired the development of Nazi flying discs. After World War II, the underground base at Nordhausen was rebuilt in the Mojave Desert, a place we now know as Area 51. But the event was sighting took place, and uh, we, I'm just completely baffled right now. Uh, so is uh, Mr. Anthony Hilder. Example of one of the many objects seen regularly in Las Vegas, a um, very bright object, just uh, basically hovering over Las Vegas, um, 5.30 p.m. Um, cylindrical uh, object, a craft. We believe it could be some kind of an observation uh, uh, platform. In 2003, the skeptical magazine Fortean Times claimed that no such craft or Nazi secret space program had ever existed. But we have been given patents from leading German manufacturing companies, including Juha, Krupps and BMW, which proved beyond all reasonable doubt that Hitler considered the Nazi secret space program a top priority. And more than 15 billion Deutschmarks were spent developing craft of all shapes and sizes. Secret memos from SS officers revealed that Werner von Braun and Hitler both believed that there were alien civilizations in the universe and it was their intention to not only conquer all nations on planet Earth but to also colonize the moon. <laughs> 